Chris, what is our second main topic today? Topic two comes from Michael Johnson. Happy Wednesday, Campia crew. Nearly 20 years after delivering her Razzie-nominated turn in the multi-Razzie-winning Catwoman, Sharon Stone might be making a return to the comic book genre. She's in talks to join the DC movie Blue Beetle to play the role of Victoria Cord. What are your thoughts on her possibly joining this film? This has been a really interesting project that they've been bringing together because you guys remember when they first announced that they would be doing the DC character Blue Beetles movie, it was originally announced that it was going to be for HBO Max, much like the Batwoman or Bat, uh, yeah, Batgirl, the Batgirl movie that's coming out. Then a little while ago, they did an about face and they said, you know what? No, we really believe in this thing. We're going to put this thing theatrical. This is going to be a theatrical movie. Then they went and they got themselves, I cannot, I never know how to pronounce his first name. The kid from- uh, Cobra Kai. What's that? And the kid from Cobra Kai playing From him? Cobra Kai yeah. and uh, Zeal, I, I don't know how to pronounce his name. I never have. Because I, it's one of those names I've read a million times that I've never actually said it out or heard <laughs> it spoken out loud, that he's gonna be on it. And now a very interesting little piece of information here. Sharon Stone, who I know Rob has a hot toy figure of Sharon Stone, or at least uh, a, 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 a- A quarter scale statue. A quarter scale oh, wow. statue. From Basic Instinct, I mean- Basic Instinct of you know, Sharon Stone. It's Grace Kelly in Rear Window. And Sharon Stone and Basic Instinct are the two, fan, my two fantasy. If I could marry a, a movie character, mm, mm -hmm. so I'd want to marry one of those two girls. It women. sounds like out of nowhere comes her name that she's going to be the villain in Blue Beetle. Now, this comes to us from Joe Blow right the following. According to the rap, Sharon Stone is in final talks to play the villain in the upcoming Blue Beetle movie. Stone will play Victoria Cord. So if, the, if that name is ringing a bell to some of you, at least the last name it should, yep. who is said to be a new character created for the movie. It was also announced that Raul Max Trulio from Mayans MC, I love his character in Mayans, uh, will be playing uh, Carapax in Carapax the Indestructible Man. In DC Comics, Jamie Re uh, Riaz, or Jaime Riaz, I should say, becomes the third person to take on the mantle of the Blue Beetle after Dan Garrett and Ted Cord, notice the last name of Sharon Stone's villain, uh, when he discovers a Blue Beetle scarab that morphs into a battle suit, allowing him to fight crime and even travel through space. Now, this is where it gets really interesting. First of all, there's two interesting things here. One, Sharon Stone being in this DC movie, which is great to me. But secondly, the fact that her last name is Cord mm -hmm. and that she's the villain of the film. Now, a lot of people, when they first announced that they're doing a, a Blue Beetle movie, they actually thought Ted Cord was going to be the Blue Beetle because there there have been several of them. Ted Cord's yeah. kind of been the one that's been the longest tenured Blue Beetle. And has the relationship with Booster Gold. Right, and is the one who has the relationship with Booster Gold. So a lot of people thought that. So it'll be wonder, I wonder, and Rob, I'm going way out of limb with nothing to stand on here. That's okay, I we wonder, do that all the time. <laughs> I wonder if the storyline here isn't becoming revealed to us here. I wonder if Ted Cord was Blue Beetle, betrayed by his sister, mother, whatever, Victoria Cord, played by Sharon Stone, and the scarab went to Jaime. I mean, I, I just wonder if that's being revealed to us now. Could so, be. I mean, I, I think it sounds interesting. What do you think about this? I know you are a Blue Beetle fan. I know you are a Sharon Stone fan. How does this news strike you? What stands out to you the most? Well, I mean, look, I, I'm a huge fan of Sharon Stone. And, you know, I'd like to see a stone assance happen because after Basic Instinct, she did Casino that she got a, an Academy Award nomination for, which I thought she was terrific in. Um, I think, yeah, this could very well be something along those lines. It sounds like that's kind of where they're going with it but i love the fact that they're doing a blue beetle um uh movie i i think it's really interesting it looks great they've shown some production art our our friend philip boute who i did an interview with for the designing hollywood podcast that's on this channel john he's working on this right he's now. working on it right now and uh he he's really enthusiastic about it he couldn't really say anything but um uh, I, I think this project is shaping up to be quite good. I, I, I can't wait to see it. I'm glad that it's going to be a theatrical release. Chris, you hear about this. Number one, the person who wrote in brings up a good point. This will be her second spin at playing a villain in a DC movie. First one didn't go so well. One of the three worst films maybe ever made in Hollywood history. But what do you think about Sharon Stone? What do you think about the fact that she comes from the Cord family? Yeah. How are you feeling about the movie overall in general right now? 
Well, I love me some Sharon Stone. I think she's mm -hmm. wonderful. I'm so happy to be seeing her doing more stuff. She was on that delightful Will Arnett improv show on Netflix um, where oh, yeah. the guest star. Oh, the murder mystery yeah. one where the copy, where they improv the whole thing? Yeah. That's and she's, crazy, that she's show. She's hysterical on it. It's so fun because he keeps trying to talk about how he shouldn't fall, she shouldn't fall in love with him. And she's like, yeah, no problem. No problem. <laughs> it's so good. Uh, so I'm so happy to see her doing more and more stuff. I've always loved her. The Cord last name is fascinating because we, of course, have Cord Omniversal. So is she going to be a power hungry executive who wants the Scarab and its technology for herself? Is there a direct uh, correlation to Ted? You know, there's a lot you can unpack there. And I think it's going to be really interesting. I'm hoping it's a bunch of family drama that we're going to see mixed in here. I think that'd be really fun. By the way, I, one of the I've only seen about two episodes of Murderville. Mm -hmm. One of the ones that I watched was the one with Marshawn Lynch. But he's got, amazing. Oh, so funny. God, so, he's, so funny. That I love so Marshawn Lynch. Fun. I love Tom Ta has been talking about Marshawn Lynch for so long and has been showing me clips of him in interviews since before he was doing any acting and also just tells me stuff that he hears about him. And I'm like, you know what? I there's not a lot of like professional football players that I would want to actually just be friends with and hang out with. I would love to be buddies with Marshawn Lynch because he just seems like someone who is so awesome and he's so funny. And I, I, I and, and I he also is a very smart business person yep. from what mm -hmm. he did with his NFL money and said, you know what, I would like to retire at a time when and, and, and when all, everybody would be going out and ordering like steaks and the most expensive bottles, he'd be like cheeseburger, you know, like he would he kept his money. He made strong but decisions. But let's talk about Sharon Stone. Oh, right, sorry, 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 sorry. <laughs> I forgot what we were talking about. I love Mark Rodland. I want to be your friend. As a former Seahawk, he's one of the greatest. Yes. Um, I am so excited about this. I love Sharon Stone. I, I would also love a Stonesance. I think that's a fantastic term, and I think we should absolutely use that as much as possible. She's a brilliant actress. Basic Instinct 3. What? She can do it. Oh, you're She can do it. Uh, Come basic on. Basic Instinct 3, if she is executive producer and has full approval over every single shot in that film, I still think it was so... If you don't know the story behind uh, the famous Flash in, in Basic Instinct, it, it's a really messed up story that um, today she could sue the bejesus out of everybody involved. And it's really... It's just a, another one of those horrible stories of what has happened to women in Hollywood and also her treatment on the set of Casino, also horror story, um, you know, and so this is a woman who has persevered. If you don't know the stories I'm talking about, go look it up. They're really interesting. Um, she has persevered. I loved her in Ratchet. If you saw the the, the series um, uh, Ratchet that she did, she was really fantastic. She also uh, was in The Disaster Artist. And I remember when I um, my agent called me and said, so you're being offered you know, this role in The Disaster Artist. This is what it pays. But if it makes you feel any better, Sharon Stone is getting paid the exact same amount of money. And I was like, <laughs> well, if Sharon Stone takes the deal, I'll take the deal. Who am I? Um, so yeah, she, I, I think she's a phenomenal actress. And also I was kind of doing a little bit of a reconnaissance on her representation situation. And she, in 2017, she signed with uh, one group of representation and she's no longer with them. She's with someone different. So uh, Artists International Group, uh, her managers currently, clearly you are responsible for the stonisance we are about to see. And I humbly thank you. All right, guys. Question is for you. It looks like we're going to get like Hollywood icon Sharon Stone as the villain in Blue Beetle. What do you think about that? What do you think about the fact that her character's last name is Cord? Are you looking forward to this? Whatever your thoughts are, jump down to the comment section below and leave those thoughts there.